What's up everybody, Titan back with some more Bioshock Infinite Barrel at Sea Guides. This time I'm doing the Cook and Serve and Rooftop Ruffian Guides. In order to do this, you must make five enemies explode with radar range and damage 15 foes with an exploding enemy with the radar range. Now, in order to make an enemy explode with their radar range, you have to hold it on an enemy long enough for them to turn completely red and then for them to explode. And that explosion does damage to enemies surrounding them. And for the first one, you must make five enemies explode by holding down the shoot button and letting them get fully red and then explode. And it's pretty simple. And you can actually do it from a pretty good distance too, so it's actually pretty easy to make people explode using the radar range. And you find the radar range by finding the audio log that tells you where it is. It'll actually give you an objective to go find it and it gives you the numbers in order to open up the door. That's cook and serve. And that's make five enemies explode with the radar range. Now, in order to make 15 foes get damaged with an exploding enemy, you have to be within range of an enemy. And if you saw there, when that person exploded, you saw the 1,000 pop up onto the screen and what that indicates for you is that the other person that did not explode got hit and you can see that 1000 just kind of fall off the screen right next to the guy indicating that person took damage from the person that exploded it's actually really easy to be able to see when somebody gets damaged and if you can get a group of people together you get three or four people that are near each other it's actually pretty easy to get the chain reaction achievement by having them just explode and it's it's pretty awesome actually i think i had somebody on a lower floor and a guy on the upper floor and i blasted the guy on the lower floor and the person above him took damage so it has pretty good range and i believe you can upgrade it as well with the range of the explosion if you upgrade the radar range so it makes it that much easier but that is all for this video so thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys next time